Good afternoon, my fellow friends and YouTubers. This is Kurt, and welcome back to the Kurt's Place channel here on the YouTube. Well, guys, it's time for another feature car video for the channel. Now, this one we're going to be checking out Gary's 1970 beautiful Chevelle here. We're at the Jimmy Cone in Manor, Maryland. It's April 6, 2024, and I want to go ahead and show you this beautiful car here. And as always, thanks again for watching. Don't forget to click that subscribe button if you like what you see. Don't forget to smash that like button. And if you have any comments, leave those in the comments section down below. And as always, thanks again for watching. Let's check it out. Okay guys, let's go ahead and check out this beautiful Chevelle here. Now Gary's gonna tell you a little bit about this car and we're gonna go ahead and find out. It's a, it's a real beauty, guys. This is one of the reasons you gotta come out to Manor to check out these beautiful cars. All right, Gary, so tell us a little bit about your Chevelle here, Gary. So this has been in the family for about 30 years. Um, my dad got it when he was 16 years old. He was going up to Pennsylvania looking at colleges and saw this sitting at an ice cream shop and uh, talked to the guy about it. And um, he didn't want to sell it, he had just restored it. It used to be a midnight gray with black racing stripes on it. And he just repainted it red and redid the interior. And uh, he got his phone number and wore him out for like two months. And he finally, right. finally eventually sold the car to him. And he's been in the family ever since, so nothing's changed. Yeah, that's a beautiful car, guy. We'll tell you, so, so, yeah, let's, let's go check out all the details. Guys, notice, guys, the rally wheels and everything. This car, it is beautiful, guys. This is a beautiful car. Tell us a little bit about the motor there, guy. What, what are we looking at in here? So it's a 396 with a quadra dip carburetor in it. Um, I rebuilt that about a year ago and put a new MSD uh, racing distributor in the back there. Uh, that's the only thing that's ever been altered to the engine. It's not matching It's not matching numbers car, so it's not the original motor to the car itself, unfortunately, but um, it's been in there ever since we've had it. And you guys can see how clean that, look how clean that is, Gary. That is beautiful. That is a beautiful, clean engine compartment. I love it. Love to see that. Hey, guys, check out the grill. And notice the grill and everything on the front. Now, Gary, what I like most about this car is the fact you kept it all original, you know? And that's one of the things that it's hard to find, guys, but it's, you notice this car is all original. We'll go ahead and get a view of this side, too. Now, if you guys are familiar with the movie Dazed and Confused, this is the car just like they had in Dazed and Confused. So that's one of the reasons I always love these. They always stand out. Really, really cool stuff. We'll go ahead and we'll check out the interior, too. Gary, you got a beautiful car here, Gary. Tell us a little bit about the interior. Did we do any, anything with the interior? All pretty much original interior? All pretty much original, as far as we know. Um, I don't really have any information on what the gentleman before we owned it did to it. Um, so I have no idea. The seats and everything are in gorgeous shape. The door panels, very, very nice shape. Very good shape. I like the gauges you have down there too, Gary. That's really. Yeah, we just installed this. I just installed them probably uh, seven months ago. And you guys gonna see how beautiful that that car is in such good shape. And the back is really good too. Really, really good stuff there, guys. Look how clean that, look at the door, how clean the door panels and everything are. And that's one of the things I was admiring, Gary, when I looked at this car too, you know, is, is the fact that, you know, the tray and everything in the back and everything, look how clean all that is back there, guys. It is absolutely gorgeous. And even, even the trunk, guys, look at the trunk, even the trunk area, look how beautiful that trunk area is. It's just gorgeous. And that paint absolutely, guys, that paint absolutely pops too. Really, really great stuff. Yeah, that's really great. We'll check the other side out too. So, Gary, how many miles do you have on how many miles do you have on the car right now? I was going to ask since you got it. How many do you, do you know how many original miles it has on it? No, I do not. The odometer is rolled over, so it shows eighteen thousand right now. So it could be one hundred eighteen to eighteen. I'm not. I'm not sure at all. Yeah, it's beautiful. Yeah, you guys see the beautiful. And Gary, you know, I like it too, the fact you kept the original wheels too. That's something, so many times they change out the wheels, but the fact you kept that, kept them original like that is amazing. Really, really great stuff. And Gary, how long did you say you had the car now? I just think you told us, I just forgot. You say you had it for how long now? Uh, my family got it in the late 90s, uh, yeah. I believe 99 or 2000. And you guys see the beautiful hood, guys, look at that beautiful silhouette there in the hood there. That's absolutely gorgeous. Oh, that's awesome car. We got the badging over here, guys. Really, really cool. Really awesome stuff. So that's really cool, guys. So this is one of the things, guys. You know, Gary. You know, Gary. By the way, I want to thank you once again, man, for sharing your car here on the on the uh, the Kurtz Place channel here on the YouTube. Now, guys, I want to mention something. There's other feature cars on the channel as well. If you want to check those out, just look under my car under my channel under feature cars, and you'll get a chance to see those as well. Uh, there's rat rods in there. There's a jet boat. All sorts of fun things to check out when you're when you're looking at the Kurtz Place channel on YouTube. Well, Gary, I want to thank you once again, by the way, Gary, for showing us the uh, showing us the beautiful car today. Always good to have you in. 
thank you very much. Yeah, yeah, no you. worries, no worries. All right, guys, so we're going to go ahead and wrap it up there and say once again, Gary, thanks for showing it to us. Now, I want to mention, guys, that remember now, I try to come to all the Jimmy Cones there every first and third Saturday, starting in April, and usually running, usually running through October. So if you get a chance, you can come and check out beautiful cars like Gary Chevelle here. Also, check out the van. You get a chance to meet me, ask me questions, and have a great time. All right, guys, I want to thank you once again for tuning into the Curtis Place channel. And I also want to mention, if you want to help to show your support for the Curtis Place channel, I do a merchandise available from the Curtis Place channel store. You can get things such as hats, mugs, and keychains. And in addition to that, I want to also mention that I try to do two to three, two to three videos a week. I try to have my premiere videos every Sunday between 12 and 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time with an open chat room. And keep in mind, I try to do two to three videos a week when you're watching a video. If you look at the top right-hand corner, there's links to other videos. You can check those out as well. And if you get a chance to, I feel free to go and check out all the other videos on the channel as well. I want to thank you once again for tuning in to Kurt's Place channel. Hope you all have a great day. And I will catch you in the next one, guys. Have a great one. I'll see you next time. Take care now. Bye-bye.